Okay, so meron tayo dito ng Google Form entitled Quiz Number One in Mathematics. This is a five-item quiz. Okay, so we have one, two, three, four, and five questions. Okay, basically this is not a quiz form. So paano natin na yung gagawin quiz form? Ito ng ating quiz number one in mathematics. Okay, so just click this gear icon. Ito yung ating settings. Then, it will give you three types of settings. The general, the presentation, and quizzes. Since gusto natin doing quiz itong form na to, punta tayo kay quizzes. Okay? Activate lang natin itong button na ito. Make this a quiz. Okay? And in quiz options, in release grade, we can choose one dito sa immediately after its submission or later after manual review. So, iwan na natin naka-check si immediately after each submission para nakikita agad ng students natin yung kanilang scores. Okay? So, also the respondent can see their missed questions, their correct answers, and point values. Okay? So, leave na natin ang naka-check. And then, click save. So, once na ma-save na natin yan, ang Google Form na natin ngayon ay isa ng quiz. Okay? So, pwede na tayong mag-set ng mga scores and answer key sa bawat tanong. Example natin kay question number 1. So, which expression shows a prime factorization? Okay? So, click natin ito. Then, lalabas dyan si answer key. Then, click answer key. Piliin natin ang tamang sagot. So, the correct answer is D. So, ilang points meron itong ating question number 1? So, bigyan natin ng 1 point. Okay, all set na. Then, click done. Okay, so same procedure lang ang gagawin natin doon sa mga natitirang questions. Okay, so question number 2. Click natin yan. And then, click answer key. Choose the right answer. So, which equation represents 36 less than a number? Y is equal to 13. Ano kaya ang tamang sagot? Okay, the correct answer is A. Then, ilang point na ibibigay natin? So, we have one point. Then, click done. Okay. So, for number 3, which of numbers is ordered from least to greatest. So, input tayo ng answer key sa number 3. Answer key. Okay. Aling kaya dyan ang tamang sagot? So, the correct answer is letter B. So, though wala siyang letter, ano? So, pwede naman natin siyang lagyan ng A sa unahan, ng B, ng C, and D. So, nasa sa atin na po yun kung lalagyan natin na letters. Okay? So, the correct answer is the second answer. Okay? Ilang points? Or ilang point? We have one. Then, click done. Okay? So, for number four, what is the value of 4x plus 9 when x is equal to 4? Okay? So, the correct answer is 25. By the way, click the answer key. Okay? The correct answer is 25. How many points? 1. Click done. And last, what is the value of P in 24 is equal to 2P? Okay? Click. Input answer key. So, the correct answer is letter C. And then, set points. Bigyan natin ang 1. And then, click done. Okay, all set na yung ating quiz number 1 in mathematics. Okay? So, to test our quiz, we can click 
this eye icon, di parang mata, for the preview of our uh, quiz. Okay, so write your name. Juan de la Cruz in section 6 Mabai Okay So pwede nang magsagot si student dito sa mga natitira questions Okay So random natin yung ating mga sagot Okay so, Click submit Once na masubmit na yan, student, they can view their score by clicking this button, view score. Then, lalabas na yung kanilang total points. So, I got 2 over 5 in this quiz. Okay? So, pwede rin natin makita yung uh, mga correct answers. Okay? So, for example, uh, this number, number 1. So, the correct answer is the last answer. So, choices natin. Okay? For number 2, the correct answer is the first answer in the choices. So, in number 3, okay, so tama tayo dun sa sinagot natin. In number 4, tama din. In number 5, okay, so the correct answer is the third answer dun sa choices natin. Okay, so paano natin magagather yung uh, scores ng ating students? Okay, so balik tayo dun sa ating Google Form. Okay. Yeah. So as you can see, meron tayong responses dito. Meron na siyang isa. Dahil sumagot tayo ng isa, okay. For Juan de la Cruz. Okay. So you can uh, also view the insights, the frequently missed questions, and the name of the uh, student, the section, okay at yung mga tanong natin. Okay? So, to gather their scores, okay? So, just click this icon, icon of spreadsheet, okay? create spreadsheet, then, create a new spreadsheet, quiz number one is mathematics, then, click create. Okay? So, magagawa yan ng bagong spreadsheet kung saan nakarecord yung scores ni Juan de la Cruz. Okay? So, kung marami ng respondents or marami ng nagsagot sa quiz natin, lalabas lang yan dito sa ilalim ni Juan de la Cruz together with their scores at pwede na natin i-record sa ating record or grading sheet. Okay? So, ganyan lang ang paggagawa ng ating quiz sa ating Google Forms. Okay? So, I hope you like it. So, don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more videos.